Hi, I'm Pete Kutzer with the Orvis Fly Fishing Schools. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how we can fine tune that double haul and make it a little bit easier. When we're making this double haul, we want to make sure that we have a good cast first. That's the most important thing. A good cast is going to get that fly out a lot easier. And if we try to incorporate a double haul to a bad cast, it's not going to go very nicely. So we want to work on that good cast and we want to look at how we make that good cast. I like to use a little bit of my forearm and a little bit of my wrist. I'm going to start by bringing this rod back with my forearm, then applying a wrist flick. That wrist flick gets that line to jump out. A lot of people have a tendency to use a little too much wrist. All I want to do is just straighten that wrist out. Notice when I start, my wrist is slightly bent. The rod's kind of in line with my forearm. Now when I make that flick, my wrist is nice and straight right here, and that's it. We're going to start with that nice back cast, and I like to lay down the ground when I'm practicing my double haul. Then, I'm going to make that nice cast on the forward cast, trying to get that line as straight as possible. If you see that line going nice and straight behind you, nice and straight in front of you, now it's time to introduce that double haul. To do this double haul, when we make this cast, notice how I make a flick at the end right there, and then I come forward and make another little flick here on the forward cast. If I take my wrist out of the picture and just haul there and there, notice I didn't use any wrist, I get the same results. The wrist flick and the haul do the same thing. We want to put those two together. When you practice, haul, but then we have to slide back. We have to reposition to set up for that forward cast haul. If we can get that practice down one side at a time, we're going to work on a nice progressive method to really get this cast happening a lot sooner and a lot easier. Practice one side at a time, laying that line down on the grass behind you, laying it down in front of you. Once you get comfortable, then try to pick it up a little bit and just lay the line down on your forward cast. If you get comfortable there, maybe come a little higher. Comfortable there, a little bit higher, and then you can add a little bit of shooting line, start getting a little bit more distance. This double haul makes a good cast better. It doesn't make a bad cast good. Keep that in mind, but practice it, and I'm sure it'll help you catch more fish.